Greetings, everybody. Chaplain Bob Walker here, Light of the World Ministries. In John 8, 12, Jesus said, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. This is part of the uh, Wilderness and Survival series. I uh, This is going to be on survival books. You know, the uh, Boy Scouts, believe it or not, uh, the Boy Scout manual had some really good survival type information. But there's also other really good books, too. For example, uh, there's a guy named uh, Lofty Wiseman. He's got the uh, SAS Survival Handbook. And for those of you that are not from the UK or England, the SAS stood for Strategic Air Services. Uh, they're sort of kind of like our uh, the U.S.'s... Uh, like the Green Berets or the Army Rangers or Special Forces. Um, you know, they would be uh, like the paratroopers and what have you. They drop them behind the lines where they would raise all kinds of havoc for the enemy. Uh, also, the uh, U.S. Air Force has a survival book, type book. It's got lots of good information in it. You know, I mean, think about it. If you're a pilot and your plane gets shot down or quits working for whatever reason and you got to bail out, um, you know, they may not be looking for you right away because uh, they might be busy or maybe they don't know where you're at. I don't know. But uh, you, it's always good to have this kind of information. I've got an entire playlist on wilderness survival by u.s old u.s army and air force films and believe it or not world war ii was called the army air corps the air force didn't even come into existence until i think it was 1947 or 48 uh was the creation of the air force before that it was part of the army so some of these books are actually very very good uh, information wise so the next part of this series is going to be on edible plants do you know that there's all kinds of edible plants that grow wild and I'm not talking about the stuff that grows in the garden you know I'm talking about uh, books that help identify what uh, plants are edible and some of these books have got color pictures so um, you know just some things to think about but uh wouldn't be a bad thing to have in a backpack you know some of you probably have boy scout books uh laying around you know um i was in the air i was in the boy scouts back in the day um uh, and i was in the military too so uh, blessing for me is I wasn't in any of the war, so I only missed Vietnam by probably a couple of years. Yeah, for all you young people, that seems like an eternity ago, but uh, boy, no thanks. I actually knew a lot of people that were in World War II when I was a kid. Uh, they're all dying now, but uh, well, actually, I don't know anybody that was in World War II anymore. Nobody. They all died. But uh, Vietnam, even there, even the Vietnam people are getting old. So, and uh, Vietnam was 20 years after World War II. So, all right, uh, Air Force Survival Guide, SAS uh, Survival Handbook, Boy Scouts of America even has it. So, something to think about. All right, in G. Uh, all blessings, praise, glory, and honor in Jesus' name. Amen. Revelation 12, people, read it and believe it. Read it and believe it. And the woman is the church. In Jesus' name, amen.